How's it going, everybody? Inship Gaming here. I believe this is episode five now. Um, so the last episode, we pretty much just finished up the body on this this old uh, this Jesse. So we ended up cutting everything off, replacing it. Um, I did keep the floor and that rear panel. You can see it's kind of beat up, but and the tailgate. But you know, it ain't nothing. It's not going to be a show class car, so it's just old shop truck. I did off camera get the doors cleaned up. They actually lined up. I had to persuade them a little bit with a hammer, but nothing too crazy. Um, so I believe we are ready. We need front tires and motor and trans, and then to finish the inside. And we'll have a we'll have a roller or a runner. Um, but before we did that, I do want to go. We're gonna take a taxi to the junkyard. And we need to pick up our next project. All right, junkyard's loaded in. Let's go say hi to this guy. I know what you did last summer. You don't know anything, buddy. Um, so we got to decide on the engine. I'm really leaning towards this old, you know, leaning tower of power here. Uh, but again, at the same time, the V8's nice. Center console for a wolf. But golly that's why you don't drift in the snow kids you'll end up like that let's get something a little different uh we've been doing uh these lads lad coops and stuff i'm thinking maybe got a couple barts here don't want a wolf god i hate the wolves uh, let's see what we got. It's a little rally hood for a lad. It's not bad looking. I wonder if that'll go in the backpack. Alright, so it doesn't look like there's a whole, whole lot of stuff. Uh, let's see. Dude, that sucker right there is... It's gonna need a lot cut off of it. But what is holding that motor in? The head's bad. Golly, Lee, fifty three hundred, I'd rather not. We ain't got that kind of bread right now. Um this one doesn't need a whole lot cut off of it. Color condition's good. Let's look for a wolf. Okay. Niv. That one's 4,400. It's got a V8. It's got a good block. Um, nope. Nope. Block is not no bueno. Okay, so it's got two good pistons. That's a plus. Ah, da, 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 da. Pretty, pretty roached. Why is there wires? How much they want for this? Let's buy it. I think we could turn a profit on that one. Um, I mean, that's a lot of our money, but at the same time, I think it'll be fine. Uh, you have a good day, buddy. And so tell that we'll drive down here and put the hood on it. It's no big deal. Get that transmission. Um, let's go to the house. See where our sign is. Okay. Back to the junkyard. We're just spending money at this point. Tow this bad boy to the sign and back to the house. Okay. So. We need to build a motor for this, but we have no money. So, that's worth, let's say, 4400 as it sits. Let's clean this up. I think we should be able to... Uh, 
hopefully get about seven, seven grand for it. And eventually, we'll do we'll keep these cars. Uh, but right now, I'm 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 in desperate need of money. And, you know, we could even do a few transmission jobs on the side once we get the shop truck out of the lift area. That cleaned up. Okay. So on these videos, I've been doing either flipping or doing working on the shop truck. Um, so I think today I'm going to do a little of both to try to, you know, mix it up. Okay, so that's that. Maybe this first half we'll try to clean up the rust. Maybe the rust will just go really fast. And uh, we can get to building the motor. Kind of hard to do a lot in 30 minutes. Sounds like a lot of time, but... This game will really chew it up. And I tell you what, we got wheels and tires. How many we got? We got one. Well, that'll get us on the road ish. Let's we find another one. Okay. That thing is pretty rusty. Yeah, so this this is still no mods. Um, I haven't messed with the mods. Honestly, I don't feel like it. So, I'm just going to keep on keeping on. I've been having such a good time playing this with no mods, no headaches. It's, uh, it's really nice. Probably need to pull that trim panel off. Alright, All right, cool. Uh, how is the rust? Oh, there's a little rust on the hood. Or that's on the fender. We got a little on the door, so most likely on the inside. Or not. That's fine. Cool. Uh, how are we doing on rust? Rust is... Damn. So I said I wanted eight. And we may get ten once we get uh once we get it painted. Alright, what are we looking at? A fifty seven FC zero. A fifty seven FC zero. Just gonna try to buy one can. Got that bubble gum pink. A little dirt there. Okay. On the bottom of the door, the rocker panel. Yeah, that's a that was a quick flip here. I figured it was gonna take a lot longer than that. Probably need to pull that bumper off, but see how the paint condition is when I'm done. Okay. Uh, one more of them. All 
Friday. Color isn't r completely. And I don't think any of that can be painted. Do I have to paint the... Let's uh, let's pull the bumper. Let's see what we're looking at. Now how we doing? There we go. That's all she needed. All right. What did we pay? It was like, what did I say, 44 or something? Almost 11 G's. Literally, I spent whatever I paid for the car, $100 for a tow, and $40 for paint. And that's money. That's money there. All right. So let's go. Let's do the Leaning Tower at Power. Um, I don't have a, I don't have an engine stand, so we're going to do this shade tree style. It will be building, um, on the ground. Okay, so I'm not going to throw any, any kind of performance at this thing. Or maybe, yeah, no, it'll be fine. Uh, oil pan... Do need a tank. That's all horsepower stuff. All right, let's see what we have. Um, probably. No, 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 don't do that. Don't do that. Woo. Alrighty. We got the block. Okay. Be driving this. Oh man, I forgot to take that wheel off that car. It'll be fun. We'll pick up something. Pick up another project. Try to find one with two wheels. All right. Sorry about that. Let's see. Got the kids are home with the flu, so. They are whiny as can be. So I built a couple cars uh, in another save account just to test them out, see if I liked them. And I am going to recreate them in this one. You're going to work with me, buddy. There we go. Uh, what else do we have? We can throw the cam in. All right. Uh, we don't have heads, so none of that works. So we need a head gasket. We do have a head. 
I need a head gasket and a there yeah, like a yeah chrome valve cover head gasket put that there there's the head One, two, three, and four. Valve cover. Okay, uh, now that we have the head, oh crap, I forgot they both go on the same side. And the thermostat housing also goes on this side. Um, I'm trying to think if it'd be better just to throw it in the car, but probably not. What else we need? We need all the front accessories. Distributor. Got all that. Crankshaft fully. Got some. Two spark plugs. We are going to throw a performance carburetor on it. Fan. Now, so what I've learned, the easiest thing to do, if you're doing these these engine swaps, a lot of times, like on the LADs, um, if you do a V8 or a diesel or anything, it clips through the radiator, like the front accessories and stuff does. So it's kind of a pain to get these on. You can go ahead and put the hoses on already. and then just set it in there. Don't fill it up because if the motor's not in it, it'll just drain out of the bottom hose. But you can go ahead and get that all set up and everything. Um, and it'd be a lot better. Right. Oh no. no, 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 no. Every damn time. I don't know why it does that. Did that on that 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 Impala I built? If y'all remember, um, it like clipped through the floor, and yeah, it was it was a nightmare. Well, that's rusty. Hmm. Guess that's too bad. There we go. All right, now we can let it down. Okay, so let's get to cracking at this stuff. I guess one thing at a time. This will have a cable there. We got the flywheel first. Then we need the clutch. That's another thing I'd like to see. If they do... If um, if you put an automatic in it, uh, you you don't need this clutch and flywheel setup. You need a torque converter with a flywheel. That's something I think would be really cool if they if they could incorporate that. Uh, so that goes on the crank, right? That goes on the cam with one screw. Then we need the. Time and chain, which I thought I bought. Uh, 
Either it clipped through the ground or I didn't buy it. And I don't have the no clip mod, so if it clipped through the ground, uh, goodbye. So let's, I guess, buy the timing chain. Uh, where the hell did it go? Am I, am I overlooking it? Am I losing my mind? Okay. You know, three timing chains for the price of one. Or three for the price of three, I guess it would be. You know, it's just money. You'll make more. Okay. Uh, alternator, which I seen right there. Got one there, one there, and the belt. Uh. Alright, uh, what else can we go on there before it freaking clips out. Cool goes on there. Oh. Yeah, that'll have two bolts. And we need a fuel pump. Spark plugs do go on this side. Yeah, it's fine. It's your world. We're just living in it. Alright, this will go on. Don't think you have to tighten this one down. Nope. Alright, uh, what else do we got? We need a fuel pump, for sure. And a starter and an oil filter. So stuff is falling through the damn map. Look. Yeah. Great. Got half a motor down there. Let's, uh, let's put our stuff up for... We lose it all. Okay, so we need both of these. Oh my god. Alright, I think now would be a good time. 
set it in there. Carburetor. Alright, and I'm not going to be like we play. Mine gets an oil filter. <clears throat> Mine gets an oil filter. Oh, I'm losing my mind. got to be something with the ground. Alright. Uh, let's see. Let's lift it up. I know I have the bottom bolt for the starter. Needs tightens. Right. Needs exhaust. Let's have a drive shaft. All right, so it needs an exhaust. Let's just put the let's put this on there. Let's um go sleep on this wet couch, I guess. Get the rain to stop. There we go. Turn our old headlamp on. Alright, so do we have everything tight? Ground's tight. Starter's tight. Alternator. So we need a fuel line. And a battery. Uh, let's go all engines. Surely there'll be a battery. Yep. Batch ready. Okay. That in the fuel line. Can't do a whole lot until we get fuel. Battery's tight. There we go. It's got exhaust. It's got the whole front accessories. I think we're good, guys. Um, just in case it drains the fluids out, I'm going to wait to put the fluids on the next episode. Uh, sometimes it's real finicky about that. Um, but we got 5,700. So next episode... I am going to, we're going to go to the junkyard. I'm going to pick up another project. Something with five lugs and, and at least two wheels in our price budget. And that will get this rolling. And we'll, um, we'll have to take a, a job or something and go get a jerry can with some fuel. 
And then I think we just need a, a driver's seat. And, you know, we can just piece it together as we go. Needs glass and stuff. But, but yeah, I think I think that's it for this episode. Um, I hope you all enjoyed. I'm, I'm still having a blast playing this hard play or hard start. So, but anyways, I want to thank all y'all for watching. And I will see y'all on the next one.